Within the bustling waterways of the Port of Los Angeles, there's a clean energy pilot program that's making a splash. This is Eco Wave Power. So here we can see the Eco Wave Power floaters. Uh, when they go into the water, they start generating clean electricity. And it turns out this is actually the country's first ever onshore wave power site. Partnership with a company called Alta Sea and Shell Marine Renewable Energy. Wave energy is kind of the new kid in the block of renewable energy, so most governments didn't come up with policy yet. But in a day and age where green power sources like wind and massive solar farms are taking hits with current administration cuts, EcoWave is hoping it might be time to give blue energy a try. This is all energy generation, no batteries, because no batteries are required. There's no day or night uh, on or off waiting for wind or no wind, right? Exactly. And the technology is already generating wave power at stations around the world. Our power station in Israel is the first time in history that wave energy is connected to the national electrical grid. It works like this. Waves make these floaters bob up and down in the water, which pushes these hydraulic cylinders back and forth, building up pressure in accumulators, which then start powering generators. And these would all go on a, a, a break wall? Exactly. The Port of LA is kind of our dream breakwater for a commercial project. Uh, it's sufficient for up to 60 megawatts of power, which is around 60 households, which can be a game changer for renewable energy production for the port. This station, a proof of concept with scalable potential. In a study with Shell, EcoWave Power ID'd 77 initial U.S. sites as ready-to-go locations with maximum wave wattage. It does seem like it's somewhat of a no-brainer when yeah. you've got uh, waves that are happening all the time. Like, why don't we already have this? Wave energy haven't commercialized so far because of the complexity of it. Like, everybody was scared that it's too expensive, that it's breaking down, how to operate it, how to maintain it. So we want to keep it simple and easy. I mean, this one has the line already set, the infrastructure already set. Yeah. Exactly. And then you've got the Port of L.A. right here. Exactly. Yeah, it, it's a perfect location. We thank you for watching. And remember, stay updated on breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or watch live on our YouTube channel.